Imagine the feeling you get when you open your Instagram DMs to see that someone with a little blue check mark has slid in. Would you be nervous, excited, or do you pretend like nothing is happening? Maybe you can ask some of the fans who've had real conversations go down in the DMs with celebrities and influencers. Today we're going to talk about a few of those people as we count down the top 10 influencers caught sliding into fans DMs. At number 10, Bella Thorne. It's one thing to get a DM from someone, but it's a completely different thing to get a DM from someone who thinks that you're someone else. Catch my drift here? This is what happened between a fan and former Disney star Bella Thorne. This DM from Bella Thorne was a little mysterious and a lot weird and one fan took to Twitter to share their story about how the actress randomly DM'd them and it's actually kind of funny. According to the fan, in 2017, Bella just out of the blue sent them a message on Instagram and it was a post of Cole Sprouse. Just a random picture, nothing else. What probably happened here was that Bella probably mistook the account she messaged for the real Cole Sprouse and sent them the picture by mistake. The fan went on to say that Bella deleted the message shortly after sending it, probably because she realized it was the wrong account, but it's still kind of funny. Even though Bella deleted the message and basically pretended like it never happened, I'm sure that's something that the fan will never forget, even if it was just an accident. At number 9, Drake. Drake doesn't seem to have the greatest track record when it comes to picking up the ladies. He's been publicly rejected enough time for us to catch on to the fact that he's not great with romance, and after you hear how he tried to pick up one fan, you might really think twice about Drizzy and his love life. Drake has tried getting with a number of people over the years, and he once tried DMing Mia Khalifa back in 2015, and that didn't really take either, and she thought it was actually kind of cringy. Mia actually dished about what went down in the DMs while being interviewed by CBS Miami 560. During the interview, she was asked if any famous people had ever tried sliding in her DMs. And though she didn't give an actual name, she did say that the person's name rhymed with rake. Definitely not subtle at all. She later said that he had sent her a half naked photo and knew that, quote, his intentions were clear, end quote. I'm assuming that they never really spoke to each other until this point because of how surprised Mia seemed to have been to receive a message from him, so I'm really wondering what compelled him to just drop this photo on her doorstep like that. Like, shouldn't you have a little conversation before doing something like this? But what do I know? Now before I carry on with the list, I would like to take a moment to ask you guys to consider leaving a like on this video if you're enjoying it so far, and while you're at it, why not head on over to my gaming channel Viper Girl. I upload every day, so there's always something new and fun to discover, so come check it out and subscribe while you're there. At number 8, James Franco. Imagine having a big time Hollywood actor start talking to you on social media. Well, that's what happened to one fan back in 2014. When their DM conversation was leaked, people honestly thought it was fake, but it turns out it was 100% real and James even owned up to his actions. This all happened when James met a girl visiting New York City as an early 18th birthday present from her parents. And the two took pictures together and she tagged him, which obviously led him to finding her Instagram and later sliding into her DMs. After the two talked, for a bit, the fan even asked to see his ID to make sure that it was really him, and then their conversation continued with James asking for her number, her age, and relationship status, and whether or not he should have booked a hotel room for the both of them. Luckily, nothing ever ended up happening between them, but the fan did end up exposing their conversation online, and James faced mild backlash, but after he admitted to his mistakes, he walked away from the situation pretty much intact. At number 7, Taylor Swift. Because the pandemic took such a huge toll on so many lives, a lot of celebrities started giving back to their fans and it's honestly so heartwarming to see. Other than celebrities singing for people to lift their spirits, others have been donating money to their fans who are in need of some help for their families or just to get themselves by. This is what Taylor Swift did for a while on Twitter and she impacted so many lives in such a positive way. Some fans saw Taylor sliding into their DMs after tweeting about how the pandemic had affected them. Other than the impact that COVID has made on the health and safety of so many people, with the lockdown measures in so many countries put in place and the loss of jobs and wages felt by so many, Taylor was looking to give back to the people who support her and sent fans $3,000 e-transfers to help them with their expenses. Since these celebrities are financially capable of giving back to their supporters, it's really nice to see some of them actually stepping up to help out. Even if it barely makes a dent in the millions of dollars these celebs have, to know that they're still looking out for the public and their well-being gives me a little bit of faith in humanity. Just a bit. At number 6, LeBron James. This man tried to shoot his shot and though he does that for a living, he missed big time. 
LeBron tried sliding into the DMs of Instagram model Heidi Hoback back in 2017 and he got exposed for it and dragged for it too. Heidi posted a screenshot of the athlete's message to her social media, which said, quote, teach me how to hunt and I'll teach you how to play ball. Deal, lol, end quote. She also followed the screenshot with saying, quote, athletes slide in girls' DMs all the time, so this isn't the craziest part, but sheesh, biggest fuck I've ever seen over here, end quote. Though some people actually started coming for Heidi from the message and exposure because fans actually thought she was calling LeBron a buck, she clarified that there was nothing going on and that she meant no disrespect by her comments on LeBron's DMs. She went on to say that she was actually out hunting and had a weird encounter with an actual buck, and it happened just as LeBron sent her the message. It was all coincidence, nothing malicious. The question of how LeBron's wife feels about this whole situation definitely remains unanswered. At number five, Demi Lovato. Demi and their fans are a very close group. They are probably one fan base that is mostly positive and very accepting, and I love that about them. As a loyal fan base, oftentimes they look to each other for support in their own individual issues, and many of them who find comfort in Demi's music share a common ground. We've seen hashtags on social media, which fans use to share their stories about how Demi Lovato has helped them, but sometimes a hashtag isn't enough to truly share the bond between an artist and their fans. As some may know, Demi has struggled with their sobriety and has spoken out about it on many occasions, showing that things can get better, and many of their fans are also in the same boat as them, having gone through similar experiences. As a support system, Demi encourages their fans like they do for them. And in one instance, Demi actually DM'd a fan to congratulate them on their sobriety and encourage them to keep fighting. In the DM, Demi said, quote, You deserve to be happy. I am so proud that you took that step. It takes so much courage. Whenever you feel like you're going to slip up, tell someone. I'm so proud. 11 months, make it to 12 for me. Love you. End quote. It's so nice to see this group motivating and encouraging one another, even on social media, so this is probably one of the best DM slides out there. At number four, ASAP Rocky. Between ASAP Rocky and Drake, I'm starting to see a pattern with rappers failing at sliding into the DMs. No matter how many times you put it in a song, that doesn't mean you'll be successful every time. I'm kidding, of course, but I do have an instance where ASAP Rocky tried to slide in a fan's DMs and failed miserably. In 2015, Rocky tried sliding into the DMs of the ex-girlfriend of fellow rapper 50 Cent, and as you can imagine, it did not go over very well. 50 Cent actually exposed Rocky for his DMs and posted them to his social media along with a warning saying that ASAP wouldn't be able to afford his ex's expensive habits. Not sure if that was a dig at Rocky or his ex, but I digress. His message was a little aggressive since he and his girlfriend were no longer together, but still, ASAP Rocky replied and was a little more civil about things. The rapper responded by saying that he was just quote, inspired by Holly, and that he wasn't aware that she was his ex. He continued by saying that he had nothing but respect for the fellow rapper and that he wanted to keep things classy. At number three, Harry Styles. This next one makes me low-key jealous because I would give anything to receive a DM from Harry Styles. I mean, I'm wearing a Harry Styles inspired outfit today. I've got pink pants on and everything. Anyways, back in 2019, Harry Styles continued being his wholesome and unproblematic self when he messaged a fan to give them dating advice. A fan named Tish tweeted at Harry Styles and asked him for advice on how to handle a situation she was facing regarding her crush. In the tweet, she told Harry that she wanted to confess her feelings to a boy that she liked and she was looking for a sign that she should press send and tell them. She included a screenshot of her pending message to her crush and let the universe take it from there. Well, the universe answered and it was Harry Styles on the other line. He ended up DMing the fan saying, quote, Hello, I saw your tweet about telling someone you have feelings for them. Life is too short to not tell people how we feel, so my advice would be to go for it. If you really mean it, then there's nothing to be scared of. Be honest and vulnerable. That's what makes you feel human. And feeling human, the good and bad, is what life is. Hope it goes well. H. End quote. The fan later tweeted about how happy she was that she got that message from Harry and that Harry gives good love advice. Hopefully things went well for Tish and maybe we'll see Harry at their wedding. At number two, Shawn Mendes. Here's a bit of a heartwarming story that all started with some artwork. Twitter user Wyador had come across a drawing of a floral butterfly that was originally created by a tattoo artist from Chile. She found the image and ended up superimposing it onto a picture of Shawn Mendes as a tattoo. This tweet ended up catching the eye of none other than Shawn Mendes himself, and he ended up sliding into her DMs to ask where the original photo came from. She sent it to him, crediting the original artist, and got in contact with them. 
Sean ended up actually flying the artist to him to tattoo the design in the exact placement that the fan had tweeted. This was such a cool collaborative effort by a fan and a celebrity and just makes you realize how awesome fan bases can be when it's all positive. Now Sean has a cool new tattoo and a story to go along with it and this fan gets to say that they helped make it all happen thanks to the DMs and some creativity. And finally at number one, Justin Bieber. Imagine having a celebrity hunt you down on social media just because they thought you were cute. Well, this is what happened when Justin Bieber got the hots for someone he saw in an Instagram fitness post. It started with nutrition and fitness coach Jessica Gober and her suggestion that the gym she worked for should start posting on their social media more to get some more traction for their business. Well, Jessica's suggestion worked very well, but instead of attracting business, she attracted love. The gym posted a boomerang of Jessie holding an energy drink and somehow this post was circulated enough that it caught the attention of Justin Bieber. Since Jessica wasn't tagged in the post, Justin actually ended up DMing the gym's account asking who the girl in the post was. Jessica found out about this and posted screenshots of the messages to Twitter. Some people came for her saying that she could have been something special to Justin, but she clapped back by posting pictures of her boyfriend saying, quote, I've got everything I need right here. Unfortunately, Justin didn't get what he was hoping for, but at least he tried, and that's what matters, I guess. Now, I want you guys to tell me if you've ever had an encounter with a celebrity or influencer and how that went. Did you meet them at a convention, or was it just a casual encounter? And if you could meet any celebrity, who would it be? Tell me about it down in the comments. Anyways, that's it for me. If you enjoyed the video, make sure you guys subscribe to the channel and turn on that notification bell so you always know when there's a new video. I've been your host, Brie Room, and until next time, stay safe, make a choice, and I'll see you guys later. Bye!